What up people, Bernie back with another video. And in today's video, I'm going to react to The Sopranos Season 2, Episode 1. I'm going to try to binge these for you guys. So it's called Guy Walks In... Wait, what's it say? Guy Walks Into a Psychiatric's Office. I'm going to try to binge watch these for you guys so I can roll them out really quick. You guys said that it gets juicier. So let's go. <laughs> NASD Series 7 Stockbroker's Exam it will test your basic knowledge of stocks, bonds, and other securities. It was a very you know, Libya's crazy ass. It was a very oh, Junior's ass is still locked up. <laughs> oh no! The nephew's doing drugs! Look at her! <laughs> Learning how to drive, Meadow? Tony being a big hoe. Ooh, who's that? <laughs> Tony. Oh. Where you been? Where the fuck you been? <laughs> Did he lose weight? I he got your word. If I walk in there, I'm walking back out. I don't see you for all this time. Hmm. Not this is the way you come back to me? Do I got your word? Oh! He lost weight, didn't he? He looks smaller. Good. Yeah, I'm back, Tony. I'm tan. What do you think, I'm stupid? I don't know it. When every fucking one of my friends turns their hearts to stone against me, fuck! I need it. Okay? There was a fucking ride. Mm. So you finger me? Mm. Tell me you're my friend. That's when I knew I was in trouble, Anthony. When out of the blue, you come, and for no reason, my back is for shit. You know that. I don't want to fucking hear anymore about your back. <laughs> we met this fucking spondylolisthesis. Anyway, so my doctor, he prescribes this clinic for me in Puerto Rico. Mm. Go ahead, check. Well, you don't tell your wife you're in the hospital? That twat brought on most of this. Twat! You can't tell one feeling to me. I want to trust you, Paulie. Take the word of a degenerate cop over me. Mm. Tony, who are you talking to down there? My back, eh? Aw, they made up. <laughs> Tony's like, I love you. You fucking beast player. <laughs> yeah, you want to pat this down too? <laughs> me. <laughs> Come on. Come on, this time a real hug. <laughs> you were seeing a psychiatrist. Tony? <laughs> Something brought from Montclair. This is who leads us now. Shut the hell up. Everyone needs to talk to someone. There you go, kid. There you go. You big ball. Oh. Shit. Where are you calling me from? Oh. Are you watching me? Oh, <laughs> oh, Dr. Melfi's like, how you find me, motherfucker? Word up, lady chief. That's what's his name from a Bronx tale. Supposed to push for best things. I, I was just giving them alternatives. Shit. What type of shit is that? Pouring hot coffee on my neck. I'd be pissed. Here, this is unacceptable. Where's Maltasanti? Ah! Get back in your fucking office. Anybody else got a problem with whoopistics? <laughs> this is how they run their their office. <laughs> Tell her she can stay with us if she wants. Oh, she's playing Tony's sister. I know her. <laughs> yeah. We'll get Barbara and Tom and the kids down from Brewster. Mm -hmm. We'll make a family reunion. How you doing, Jeff? Look how big the sun got. Brother, I get a pass. <laughs> and he's still getting yeah. smacked. Hey, you look sensational, Janice, really. <laughs> Not a lie. Two beautiful kids, you must be proud. You want our jeans. <laughs> Gotta want to get in your way here, Tony. And mm. you're the one who stayed, you took the front. Barbara and I were never gonna forget that. What? You forgot it okay for about 20 years. At least Bob pitched in. Ooh. I know, I made my share of mistakes. 
Let me tell you something about the stroke of hers. And I got this from a doctor. It's, it's a big fucking opera brought up by repressed rage. It's bullshit. <laughs> there was no one fuck whatever the fuck. <laughs> she cannot take care of herself. She's on the lamb in that fucking hospital from me. Well, who did what to who? It's not my business. I mentioned you her eyes fill up with tears. Oh, boy. <laughs> I'm not asking you to step in, Tony. She's the devil. She <laughs> was. Now she's just a confused, fine old woman. <sighs> so all I need is a couple of hundred bucks to fix her car so I can get back and forth to the hospital. I just put a house on a mug. Hmm. Oh. Oh, he about to check them. <laughs> refresh my memory about this play we're making on one business. <clears throat> no re no repercussions for what they did. Blinds me for everything. Why can't this family just get along? I won't let them leave you here like this. They can't stop me from seeing you. She tried to kill your dad. Take that in the drawer. Oh boy, what? Take it. Oh my god. This was your grandmother's, wasn't it? So you won't forget me. <laughs> She's so dramatic. <laughs> Tony, calm down, Tony. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. Is he gonna pass out? Ugh. He needs therapy again. I told my family. Uh, I got broadside. I passed out behind the wheel. Hmm. You got a new therapist. A lot of screaming. 180 grand says in that place. Like he needs that. Well, I'm glad someone's taking charge. Right. What? I mean, Ma still has rights. Oh, boy. Take Ma back to see her. She came here for the house. $400 car. That was the con from the first. That's the level she works at. Oh. The sign was broken. What does she think? She's going to stop the house sale by picking up one fucking sign? She'll be here. I'll be bouncing her fucking head against the wall. Oh. It's not going to stop with the house. The $300 pillow, which we're going to fucking pay for. Then a video of it, which Jordy heard her talking about. Ooh, Tony's sister is ruthless. <laughs> She's a little sneaky snake. Oh, no. Tony. He's going to hit him. Oh no. Tony, don't lose it, Tony. <laughs> Tony's bugging. Thank you, Chucky. Yeah, that's it. Go home. Get my dinner ready. No, he did not hit her. Fork. How's the bagels in this place? <laughs> One of my patients committed suicide because I wasn't available to her. Oh. You know what that means to me? She's gone. She's in the ground because of you. Fuck you. <laughs> but I got a family. And believe it or not, they're better off with me than without me. Maybe you can recommend somebody else. I would never ask another colleague to get involved in this. Mm. I swear to Jesus Christ, nobody got killed because of you. Get out of my life. <laughs> she want nothing to do with you, Tony. What's wrong, Tony? What was he thinking about in those last moments? Kept looking at Carmella. Oh, poor Tony. You're a hot mess, Tony. All right, y'all. So that was my reaction to Sopranos Season 2, Episode 1. A guy walks into a psychiatric's office. And clearly, Dr. Melfi don't want to have shit to do with Tony. <laughs> it was a good episode. Uh, you know, pretty low-key for the most part. <sighs> guess it's going to be all a big build-up. 
but yeah that's that for this reaction you guys make sure to give this video a thumbs up drop a comment down below share my video and if you're not a subscriber subscribe bye guys